Hey guys, so today I just wanted to talk to you about Hannah's hair. Well, Hannah and Haley's hair. So you, as you know, they are identical twins that look absolutely nothing alike. But if you are newer to this channel, they are for sure identical twins because when first developing, uh, their egg actually didn't split in half, it split like 40, 60. So they are for sure identical twins even though they look absolutely nothing alike. So I just wanted to kind of talk about why I choose to have their hair differently. Like Haley has bangs and Hannah doesn't, and Hannah usually has her hair up and Haley doesn't. Uh, one of my friends from the NICU actually commented on this. She wasn't rude or anything, she was just asking. And then I thought about how if she's asking, then a million other people must be wondering why Hannah's hair is always up or Hannah doesn't have bangs and stuff like that. So I kind of just wanted to go over that with you guys and talk about Hannah's hair. So the reason that Hannah doesn't have bangs is because she actually has a really wicked cowlick. I can't remember if it's on this side or if it's on this side it's on one of the ways and it naturally just wants the part like this so if you cut her bangs which I have done I tried to do it and it was an epic fail it actually will just push it off her forehead anyways and then there'll be these little ridiculous hair and it just doesn't look good the only way you could get it to work is if you did side bangs and you pushed it to the way it didn't want to go like this so in the future she could have bangs. That's just not possible right now. She's too little, her forehead's too little, her head's too little. I just take too much maintenance and the nurses like naturally like to part it the other way because that's how it wants to go. So it just, it just would take a lot of effort and it's not really worth the battle right now. Plus, when you look at their faces, uh, Haley has a very long, narrow looking face, whereas Hannah's looks a little bit more round because she's got the chubby cheeks. Haley also looks like she has a bigger forehead than Hannah. Hannah's just like naturally just smaller, so Haley's just looks a lot bigger. So Haley actually looks a lot better with bangs than without bangs, and Hannah has such a little forehead that it's not like I think that she would look better with bangs. She looks cute without. They both would look cute with or without. That's just kind of like a hairdresser standpoint. like. When you have a bigger forehead, usually people like to cover it. When you have a little forehead, it's just so little, it doesn't really matter. That's how I think of it, so that's why she doesn't have bangs. If I could choose, Hannah would have bangs. It's not going to force her to have bangs right now. For the reason that she always wears her hair up is because her hair is actually so fine. Haley's hair is fine, but she has a lot of it, but whereas Hannah's hair is fine, but there's like none. Like You can see like her scalp really easy. It's so super thin, even like when it's... It's like frizzy and like it has like a way different like it's way different than Haley's hair. Haley's hair is like naturally straight and uh, for some reason Hannah's hair is curly and all of this differences I is because of medication. It's because the medications she's on and the diet. So eventually she might have good hair. She might have hair like Haley's when the med medicine stops or when she starts eating like regular food and gets better nutrients. But for right now, it doesn't look like it doesn't look very really nice down it can look nice it's just I don't know it, I feel like it looks better up plus it's also better that we keep it up because she does puke a lot at night so she'll puke and then obviously it's like right next to her hair so if her hair is up and contained then it's not all through her hair and as you guys know we can't bath her every single day because you have to do trach ties afterwards and it's just like a really big ordeal to bath her and I don't have a nurse every day and all of that so if we have her hair up then the puke is like being contained. Another thing for why Hannah's hair is up is her hair is actually breaking. Lately she's been in this style where she has a pigtail, like a pigtail, pigtail and then there's like a little bun on the bottom. Well Haley took a brush and brushed the bottom ponytail and it her hair is so fragile that it snapped off so now she has I think that it snapped off on both sides. I'm not really too sure. She Now she has a bunch of baby hair on the bottom, so her hair isn't even like at normal lengths anymore. And it's just, it looks a lot nicer when it's up and not like, it looks, it looks ratty when it's down. Haley's hair also isn't normally up because she doesn't like it up. Sometimes she'll ask for a ponytail and then she'll rip it out. So I'm trying to actually not put her hair ever up because she'll rip out like big chunks of her hair when she's taking out the ponytail that she only had in for five minutes. Um, so she doesn't like her hair being put up so I don't put it up and then when she does have it up she just rips it out. And Hannah actually lets us put it up her hair whereas Haley doesn't. That's why only Hannah's is up and I don't put up Haley's too. Anyways I hope that made sense to you guys. I'm not playing favorites in hair. I think that they both have, they're both their own person and that's just what works for them. 
So anyways, that's it for this video. If you liked this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, and I will see you in the next video. Bye. It's Christmas decorations. Fake presents. But why is Walter Wild? That's ribbon. It's fake presents, Haley.